How's it going, guys? Uh, we're here in the Gnarly Toy Box. Wanted to give you a little tour of the Ninja Turtle section. We've got uh, one of my favorite categories, one of the best sellers. We're always buying these two. Um, we've got Toon Turtles. They're pretty popular. I've only got three of them so far in the shop, but that's more that we're looking for. We've got uh, the mutating turtles back there. They mutate into cute little regular turtles. Um, we've got the movie turtles up here that were from the second movie. Um, those have become pretty popular. They're actually uh, a little bit more rubbery than a lot of the other ones that we get. Um, these are so popular that they do knockoffs of them. This one here is a knockoff from uh, Japan. So, um, but this is not rubbery, however. It's just hard plastic. But pretty cool. So, I guess the ultimate compliment whenever your toy gets knocked off, in a way, you know? But um, They did a bunch of op shoots as well from... Um, military to Indian to wind up to uh, Universal Monsters are some of the really cool ones. They all glow. Um, just a really vast toy line that they just kept on pumping out and are appealing to everybody from 5 to 55. During the 80s there was a lot of characters they made that went with the cartoons as well. Um, all of these were actually from the cartoon. Different ep episodes had different ones. They got Panda Con was a great one. All these different animals. Um, it's, it's great to find them. Um, all different characters from the cartoons. We've got um, Sergeant Bananas. He's a pretty hard to find one. Getting harder and harder to find. Um, the sculpts on these guys are just crazy. I love the belts on this. All the details that they put into the toys is just uh, phenomenal to me. So a lot of these toys just have uh, amazing characters that have been going from the cartoons you remember from the 80s. Um, they never stop making turtles. You can go to Target right now and get the ones from the cartoons that's current. These are the 80s cartoons. Some of the characters that you don't recognize right away are the ones that are the most rare and worth the most money. Maybe you have some of the weird characters hanging out in your house and you want to bring them down. We're buying every single day. Um, we've got uh, all the bad guys are some of our top sellers. We've got Rocksteady, Bebop, any of those guys. Um, you know, bring them on down. Get the dust off of them, bring them out of the attic, and bring them down to us. But either way, keep collecting and keep it gnarly, my dudes.